The grocery market's changing and um, red meat within that as well. And what we're seeing over time, uh, the supermarkets seeing sales constrict slightly and the high street uh, having a tougher time. But at the same time, we're seeing growth from the online presence of retailers such as Tesco and Sainsbury's, but also the real growth is coming through from discounters and that is reflected in red meat. And we're seeing them do a really good job of promoting British brands and Scotch beef within their stores to drive growth within the market. Discounters are really challenging perceptions of what a discounter is. Uh, we've seen them move towards the mainstream in the last few years, attracting more and more of the shoppers that aren't expected to be in there. So we're seeing ABC ones helping to drive growth and the demographics of both Aldi and Lidl moving in line with the big four retailers. Looking at a wider meat, fish and poultry market, we're seeing a move towards a more convenient and solution-based market. What that means for, for red meat and Scotch beef and Scotch lamb particularly is that the, the frame of reference needs to move slightly away from primary meats, which are still incredibly important for roasting, frying and grilling, but also moving into a more convenient side of things, so getting the mark out there on better products in the quality side of things like chilled main meal accompaniments, ready meals, ready to cook products, getting them out there in those options that are tied to the solution side of the market. So giving people the option to cook things quicker with less preparation and really give them a reason to pay more for them. What I think the future for red meat is is a move in the frame of reference, away from just primary products. They'll remain important, they'll remain key, but moving along a continuum from slightly processed things, such as burgers, meatballs, into a slightly more ready meal market with ready to cook products, ready to roast products, and then moving all the way on to sous vide and ready meals. So really taking a spectrum of options for quality products to give quality solutions to the population.